Hey, gun people. It gets so old sometimes dealing with all the idiot comments that come here. Something pops down on my screen, and all of a sudden, I've got to answer 400 questions from idiots with no. Oh, well, man, look, Rick, you search gay love. I didn't search it, you freaking idiots. If you guys had half a brain, it says report search predictions. This is Google pushing their crap on search predictions. And if you go up to your Google, if your search prediction is on there, and just put a slash mark right here in search, it's going to give me all these search predictions that it wants me to go to. These are, I guess, what's popular or what's being searched. I don't freaking know. If I hit another slash, it gives me all... I'm not searching Arabic letters or whatever. I don't know what the hell all these search things are. Hit the, another slash marks and it brings up these... Who the hell's Covey lyrics? I don't know who this C-Cat... I don't know what the hell all this shit is. Hit another slash, it brings up this. I think it gives you something else if you search periods. Let me put a period up here. It brings up all this writing. I don't know what the hell all that is. I didn't search all that. So how do you turn all this off since I had to take time to answer all these damn questions from all the idiots with no lives? Why are you searching little black hearts? Why are you searching? Oh, man. Dealing with idiots on YouTube is a never-ending battle. And unless you have a channel, you have no idea what a pain they can be. So let me show you how to turn this crap off because I had to research it because I got tired of answering all the idiots. So if you disable predictions altogether, it'll stop all this. So you have to go to settings and then to advanced tabs. And then under your advanced tab, you're going to see privacy and security. And right down here it says use prediction services to help complete your URLs. Yeah, okay. So you can predict gay love and other crap, other liberal left-wing Google crap. So, if you turn that off, of course, it was on by default. If you turn that off, you can stop all those stupid predictions. And you can stop answering freaking idiots on the internet who have nothing else better to do than come here and try to start shit. Alright, we'll end out there on how to turn off Google annoying predictions.